Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is all about my all-time number one summer basic staple, the denim short. Suck it. Just kidding. But you guys don't watch me for a long time, leave me for filth, and you're like, girl, where are the dresses and the skirts? They are coming. They are coming. But today, I wanted to style for you guys four different ways on how I style my denim shorts to give you guys some summer inspiration. If you guys are new to my channel, hello, my name is Amy. I am so excited to have you guys. Please make sure you guys hit the subscribe button if you haven't so you can stick around for more videos like this. And make sure you give this a thumbs up. And yeah, let's just get into these outfits. <laughs> Okay, so this outfit is literally perfect for if you guys want to go for brunch or you're going to the game or to knock back a few beers and you want to keep it casual but cute. I am taking a white v-neck t-shirt, which is a staple again in anyone's closet. I've layered on my gold jewelry from Miranda Fry just because I think it adds a little bit of dressiness to any outfit. The shorts I am wearing are most definitely the shortest shorts I own. They are my one teaspoon bandit shorts. I love one teaspoon shorts, but since my thighs have been a little bit thicker, I haven't worn them as much as I used to. For our shoes, we're going to go ahead and keep it really casual and throw on our white Keds. These were such a great piece for me to invest in this summer. They're comfortable, but they still look chic, and they're just really cute and inexpensive. And then I'm just going to go ahead and right on top of that pop my gray Zara blazer with the elbow patches. This is actually a jersey blazer, which is perfect for our more casual feel, but just adding on something a little bit tailored to this very basic outfit just kind of shows a little shape and a third layering piece is always a great idea. So right, so right, so right. I'm just going with the gut. Never had a doubt, felt like this is just a must. Put me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the cut. Everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now. We know I ain't ballin' yet. Hoes wanna holler, oh no, I don't call them back. Girl, let me see you hold it down, we gon' have a blast. Cause I just wanna know what you gonna do with all of that. Ain't gotta say a word. I takes pieces that we already have in our closet that you have seen me style different ways but I wanted to show you guys a new way to style them so I am starting out with a lace camisole I've gone ahead and done a choker from Miranda Fry and then also the Zion necklace I love this little combo just for a little bit of something on the decollete my shorts are my Levi's 501 shorts you guys these are the be all and end all if you have thicker thighs you need these shorts in your life and then right on top of that I'm actually going to put on my floral duster that came in a matching set separate set that you saw me style in my last lookbook. This duster is so extra, I love it, but I also love how girly and whimsical it is. And then for shoes, I'm gonna do my castania wedges because I want a little bit of height and they're just like the perfect summer shoe. Again, I would wear this to the mall, I would wear this to brunch, I would wear this on a date, I would pretty much wear this anywhere to be honest. You guys know how I feel about a button-up shirt, and this just takes it next level. You're doing tailored and covered on top with skin showing on the bottom. So I'm taking a white button-down from Club Monaco. I've gone for a loose gauzy button-down, but you could change up the look by doing a fitted button-down as well. It really depends. I'm tucking this in to a pair of black high-waisted shorts from Zara. And then I've just gone ahead for a little bit of glam and for a little bit of she-she-she and added my Gucci belt. For a daytime look, I have gone ahead and paired my Chanel ballerina flats with this look. Any ballerina flats work, but I love these ones because they are nude with a black cap toast. If we want it to be a little bit glam, because this is a total day to night outfit, when it gets past 5 p.m. and we're going to date night or for dinner with the girls, you can just add on a black pair of high-heeled strappy sandals or booties, and you have yourself a completely different look, but still very glam and still very chic. You better grab that tambourine. Bring the bass, we might be weak.
combines your flirty little girly elements with your shorts, which are kind of more of a standard basic piece. This is actually a sweater that I picked up from H&M. I love it. It's got that Victorian style ruffle at the neck and the sleeve. It's got your lace detailing. And there are a ton of lace cotton eyelet shirts if you don't want to do a sweater out right now that I will link below that gives you this exact same look. I just went ahead and tucked this straight into my Levi shorts because they are my favorite at the minute. I can't get enough. And I threw on a pair of slides with them for like the perfect daytime outfit when maybe the temperature is a little cooler, but you still want to wear your shorts. <laughs> you guys will be converted once you try them. So I hope that this gave you guys some ideas. If it didn't, don't worry, I do have skirts and rompers and dresses coming for you guys, but I just want to stick with what I love because summer is coming and the inspo is needed. So I hope you guys love this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. <laughs>